How's it going everybody? Welcome back to another video. Um, today I'm going to get out in central PA uh, up on a mountain stream. And this stream is actually stocked in the spring with rainbows, but it has a really good brook trout population. So I wanted to get up there today because the water in this stream is super cold. So it's going to be really good for this time of year since a lot of other streams are warm right now. Um, so we should have a pretty good morning here. And I'm going to be using my Tenkara rod. And I really, really like using that on small streams. It's, it's a lot of fun. So hopefully we can get into some fish here today. I know there's some real big stocked rainbows in here. Um, but I'll be happy to catch pretty much anything. So we'll see what happens, guys. Stick around and uh, stay tuned. All right, we got a nice brook trout here. Barbless hook on my fly. Alright guys, I actually broke off on a couple of real nice fish back at that last spot. So I moved upstream here and I found this beaver dam and I've never really fished this part of it, but I saw a huge fish rise over here. I'm going to try and sneak up and see if I can get him. Let me show you guys this beaver dam area. So the beavers have this all dammed up here. And I saw that fish over on the far right side over there. So I'm going to somehow try and sneak over there and see if I can get him. Alright, well I caught this really nice brook trout in this beaver dam area. Let me get him unhooked here, but that's that's a big brook trout. It's wild too, so not a stocked fish. Really, really cool. Alright, well that's the uh, first fish out of this beaver dam. Hopefully we can get another one here. I know I saw a big fish in here. And I don't think it was a brook trout. All 
There we go. Another little brook trout. Oh, just saw that big fish again, I think. Not sure how I'm going to get over there to him. All right, another brook trout. It's going after that bigger fish, and this guy took it. Real nice little guy. If we can get that bigger one. Oh, another brook trout. There's a lot of brook trout in this in this spot here. In this beaver dam. This is a blast. All right. There's another one. All right. There are so many brook trout in here. I'm trying to get a picture of this guy. He's so cool looking. All right, let's see if we can get some more. This beaver dam is loaded. Did not expect this when I came up here. Oh yeah, there we go. That's a really nice brook trout. Still fishing this beaver dam. All right, let's get him unhooked, get him back. I am really, really happy that I found this spot. It's like just loaded with brook trout. There we go. Oh, came out. Quick release. Kind of curious how many brook trout are actually in here. There's got to be quite a few. All right, we got a real nice brook trout now. All right, 
Wow. Got them on a dry fly too. That's awesome. Well, that's brook trout of the day right there. Really, really nice fish. All right, we got a pretty nice fish here. This fish does not want to be caught. Right. catching some really nice brook trout I didn't even know that that uh, one beaver dam was there I knew the first one was there but when I walked upstream and saw the other one that that was pretty cool because that thing was loaded with the fish um, I think there was maybe one or two stock fish in that one but mostly all wild brook trout so really really cool um, I may have to fish some more beaver dams after after this because uh, I didn't realize they had fish in them like that. So that's pretty cool. 
So, thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Drop me a comment. Let me know what you thought. And uh, if you liked it, let me know. If you didn't like me know, let me know. So, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.